ಉದ್ಧವಗೀತಾ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಟು ಪೇಜ್ ತ್ರೀ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಂಡ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ವರ್ಸ್ ಫೋರ್ಟೀನ್ ಸಾರಿ ವರ್ಸ್ ಟೆನ್ ಪೂರ್ವ ಸ್ನಾನ ಪ್ರಕುರ್ವೀತ ಧೋತದಂತೋಂಗಶುದ್ಧ ಉಭಯೈರಿ ಚ ಸ್ನಾನ ಮಂತ್ರೈರ್ಮೃದುಗ್ರಹಣಾದಿ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಲಾರ್ಡ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಟಾಕಿಂಗ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ರಿಲಿಜಿಯಸ್ ವೇ ಆಫ್ ಲೈಫ್ ವರ್ಷಿಪಿಂಗ್ ದ ಲಾರ್ಡ್ ಮೋಟೋ and method varieties of deities either in the temple or in the house this bhakti devotion comes under religious practice religious practice in that patanjali yoga sutras tapas swadhyaya ಈಶ್ವರ ಪ್ರಣಿಧಾನ ಪುಟ್ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಕ್ರಿಯಾಯೋಗ ದಿಸ್ ಕ್ರಿಯಾಯೋಗ ಎಲೋನ್ ಈಸ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಕರ್ಮಯೋಗ ಇನ್ ವೇದಾಂತ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಪತಂಜಲಿ ಕ್ರಿಯಾಯೋಗ ತಪಸ್ ಸ್ವಾಧ್ಯಾಯ ಈಶ್ವರ ಪ್ರಣಿಧಾನ ಇನ್ ನಿಯಮ ಶೌಚ ಸಂತೋಷ ತಪಸ್ ಸ್ವಾಧ್ಯಾಯ ಈಶ್ವರ ಪ್ರಣಿಧಾನ in niyamas last 3 are called kriya yoga there are people who follow only these three they are the practitioners of kriya yoga which is very much popularized by paramahamsa yogananda autobiography of yogi paramahamsa yogananda popularized this kriya yoga of patanjali but the same thing is called in vedanta karma yoga karma yoga is proper action with proper attitude is called karma yoga do all your actions with proper attitude do proper actions with proper attitude comes under karma yoga why to practice this karma yoga this purifies the person from all obstacles prayer will help a person to purify oneself to grow in spiritual path a spiritual journey which is uh, the ultimate journey of every human being where the person enjoys complete ananda complete shanti that uh, ananda is possible in spiritual life for that uh, previous chapter full of gnana yoga the culmination of spiritual journey is gnana yoga for that gnana uh, yam prapti one has to be qualified without qualification if you go to gnana yoga also there is no benefit of that gnanam or gnana phalam krishna wants to address those um, people who are devotees first recognize first i am related to god i am a devotee first relation with god only 
later only mother father brother husband wife children all these roles are vesham my first vesham should be devotee bhakta ram bhakta mera bhai tyagaraja badrachala ramdas many many great bhaktas they got the title bhakta ramdas bhakta prahlad bhakta druva bhakta tukaram bhakta mera bhai how they have got they invoked the primary role ordinary people do not invoke the primary role they invoke the secondary role they are attached to the secondary role that is why there are lot of uh, problems uh, or sufferings uh, struggles people face we may ask even bhaktas also faced a lot of problems we are thinking they have faced problems bhaktas never thought that uh, they had faced that problems they never felt but we the ordinary people think mera bhai sakku bhai dhruva prahlada they underwent a lot of torture by their own family members including tyagaraja also what sukham they have got we think <coughs> but you look at that bhakta they never feel that they never had such a feeling they are suffering struggling on the other hand they accepted those experiences what we call bitter experiences but they have taken them as a, a sweet experiences that is the difference therefore lord krishna want to say one has to invoke devotee in oneself how to invoke daily do deva yagna puja either in the temple or in the house in your poop in front of your puja room you can practice worshiping the lord before that what you have to do you have to take bath before taking bath what you have to do danta dhavanam you have to brush your teeth either with twigs or neem twig or brush okay like that you have to do purvam snana purvam prakurvita dhauta danta dhauta danta means brushing the teeth later anga shuddhaye snanam here anga shuddhi means two meanings we can take one is one's own body organs hands legs face eyes whole body each limb of the body we have to uh, clean anga shuddha this is one meaning second meaning is whatever puja dravyam you use flowers fruits whatever place you are doing puja all that dravyams we have to keep it clean that is anga shuddha puja dravyam called angams because they are also part of puja only ubhai ubhayaihi api cha snanam so danta dhavanam time and snanam time when you are doing both actions before snanam you are doing cleaning your teeth at that time also you should chant a mantra last class uh, i told you i think ayur balam yasho varchah now you have to look at the brush and chant this shloka those days they used to take and uh, go near the tree neem tree or some other tree they take the twig and they want to clean their uh, teeth they ask oh manaspati please uh, forgive me i am plucking you you please bless me i am making use of you to clean my teeth what are all things he asks early morning first prayer before that also there is one prayer before keeping your feet on the floor 
कराग्रे वसते लक्ष्मी कर्मध्ये सरस्वती करमूले स्थिता गौरी प्रभाते करदर्शन समुद्रवसनी देवी पर्वतस्थन मंडले विष्णुपत्नी नमस्तुभ्यं पादस्पर्शं क्षमस्वामी दिस इज द फस्ट प्रेयर वी हाव टू चैंड अर्ली मॉर्निंग बिफोर ब्रशिंग युवर टीथ फस्ट प्रेयर लुकेट युवर हैंड एंड डू नमस्कार then when before keeping your feet on the floor ask mother earth oh mother earth please forgive me samudra vasane devi parvata sthana mandale the shlokas you know later ayur balam yasho varchah is for the brushing treat may you oh vanaspati please give me ayush long life balam strength yashah prosperity varchah tejas brilliance prajam nice children pashu animals pet animals domestic animals cow like nowadays people are keeping dog etc if they are not there you can take car or scooter also vasu niche vasu means wealth we require all types of wealth gold is also wealth land is also wealth whatever you possess is also wealth only vasuni cha not only that brahma pragna cha may you give me that brahma pragna brahma gnanam i should not miss this brahma vidya after learning also medha cha let me have memory power to recollect त्वम नो देहि वनस्पते वो मदर वनस्पते वो ट्री प्लीज ब्लेस मी विथ ऑल दिस आई एम गोइंग टू ब्रश मई टीथ दीज आर ऑल कॉल्ड सनातन धर्म वट यू मीन मई सनातन धर्म द होल लाइफ फ्रॉम द मॉर्निंग टू टिल नाइट फ्रॉम द मॉर्निंग टिल नाइट युवर लाइफ इज ए वर्शिप because you uh, relate yourself with god with parmatma then there is a lot of uh, joy peace uh, relaxation the more you remember god in your actions uh, in every part how you how to do that snanam also danta dhavanam time this shloka what about snanam mantraihi with mantras अघमर्षण सूक्त देर इज वैदिक मंत्र आर देर आर् यू कैन टेक वाट तांत्रिक मंत्र मीन स्मार्त मंत्र यू कैन चैंट गंगा स्तोत्र मेनी ऑफ यू नो गंगा स्तोत्र बै हार्ट वी कैन चैंट गंगा स्तोत्र एज वी आर् टेकिंग बात देवी सुरेश्वरी भगवती गंगे दैट श्लोक आलो we can chant mantraihi mrudu grahana adina you have to take mrud means clay um, mud mud then means to uh, instead of soap you have to apply uh, mud in the rivers they take bath they don't apply soap you are not supposed to apply soap in the river bath because the water will become you know, the chemicals will mix with water that um, vegetarian uh, uh, soaps are coming now means other um, soaps are not vegetarian or the uh, organic soaps vegetarian soaps all are coming now those days they used to take with mud now people are going naturopathy and taking mud bath hours together they apply mud and sit in that sunlight with mud bath that shastra says means uh, how one can take mud bath uh, is a question but people are going to naturopathy centers uh, go and see people with lot of mud they sit uh, under the sunlight uh, for arogyam for beauty for nice skin they start applying mud but veda says you take mrut uh, uh, for bath and uh, no 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 how can we take uh, now people are applying to the facial also uh, in beauty parlors also they are using the mud only 
These are all said in our Shastra by Lord Krishna in Uddhava Gita itself. See, Mrudu Grahana Adina. Mrudu you can take Adipadat, some other turmeric like that you can apply. All these um, meant for purify your body. <coughs> Up to here we saw in the last class. Purification, real purification is what actually? Bath alone is not the purification. Real purification, our people chant one shloka. Apavitra pravitrova sarva avastham gato sarva avastanga topiva yasmaret pundari kaksham sabahya bhyantara suchihi real purity at uh, internal level and outer level bahya abhyantara suchi is this whether you are purified or not whether you are traveling or sitting in one place or you have taken bath or not it is not real purity real purity is yahas maret pundari kaksham who remembers god all the time his name like bhakta narada like miravai like tyagaraja all the time bhaga remembering bhagavan that is the real bhakti is that is real shuddhi that is real purity now, 11th verse. <coughs> Next to page 325. Sandhyo patsyadi karmani Vede na choditani me Poojam tai kalpaye samyak Sankalpa karma pavani After bath, what one has to do? Sandhyo pasthyadi Sandhya upasanam Gayatrim avahayami Savitrim avahayami Like that, they have to invoke um, those who have taken that upanayana karma they have to do sandhya vandanam vaidika karma also they should not give up if this puja of lord comes under tantrika puja or smartha puja with vaidika karma should not be given up those who are entitled to vaidika karma they should not give up that um, gayatri um, mantra chanting Therefore, one has to do that uh, Sandhya Vandana. Sandhya Upasthya Adi Karmani. Sandhyo, Sandhya plus Upasthya Adi Karmani. So, Sandhya Vandana, Upasana, Pratas Sandhya, Madhyandina Sandhya, Sayam Sandhya, three times one has to chant Gayatri. Those who have taken Gayatri uh, initiation. And they should not give up Shrauta Karmas while doing this Smartha Karma, Puja, etc. Karmani. Vedena Choditani Me. They are all um, prescribed by me. Choditani means they are all prescribed by me. Any symbol taken from the nature. Um, that uh, is called uh, Swayambhu Lingam, they say. The Swayambhu Lingam, when you stake, uh, like uh, Amarnath, Kedarnath, many places there are Swayambhu Lingas. Even though you are doing that worship, don't give up your <coughs> Vaidika Karma. Shrauta Smartha Vihita Karmani. Nitya Naimitika Karmani. All must be practiced. Then Vedana Chodita. By me they are prescribed. Once I prescribe them, how can you give up? Krishna is asking. 
one should not give up then after while doing this sandhya vandanam puja etc we should not think about anything family profession relations and all we have to forget those 10 minutes or 1 hour or however much time you do puja taihi kalpayet samyak sankalpah may you taihi puja kalpayet may you perform puja with what right sankalpa right sankalpa you have to include one more uh, prayer in all your prayers when you go to temple or in your house i am giving one more extra prayer ask lord hey o oh lord hmm, may you uh, give uh, this sanatana dharma should be uh, um, one what you can say sanatana dharma should be popular and everywhere it should spread all over the world then the world is dandana vanam swargam sanatana dharma spreads along with your sakama prayers you include at the last this also oh god let this sanatana dharma should spread in all people in all places that your prayer samashti prayer definitely it will work because in samashti well being total well being your well being also is there that well being we saw in the last week monday hmm, ram temple what a wave like ram wave <laughs> you know whole world is uh, the resonance of ram 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 what for so rama is vigrahavan dharma he is the one maryada purushottama maryada means he knows his limits what are all promises he does no maryada he never um, overcome or he never cross over that walk uh, uh, whatever he has given words his duty his dharma that is why rama is worshiped for what purpose rama is so uh, loved by all people because rama lived according to sanatana dharma that's why he is the model to all of us exemplary to all of us not only hindus it is uh, um, this wave rama wave is for the whole universe everybody is uh, really uh, enthralled you know enjoying that bhagavan sannidhi that is a pujam taihi kalpayet samyak sankalpah sankalpah karma pavanim that karma whatever you do once you start with puja every day 10 minutes minimum maximum 20 minutes more than is sufficient you need not sit hours together shastra never ask you how to do hours together it is your choice if you have time you can do otherwise no problem but do minimum 5 to 10 minutes like that you can start karma pavani <coughs> pavani means um, it uh, releases you from all sanchita agami prarabdha karma you will be free from cycle of birth and death then next shloka lord krishna is going to talk about what type of deity you are worshiping the lord offering flowers doing abhisheka or offering any other puja dravyam incense sticks you are showing chandan you are keeping vibhuti you are keeping kumkum you are giving bath you are giving so many things you are giving that murti that deity should be made out of what made out of what that is given in the 12th shloka shaili darumai lohi lepya lekhya cha saikati manomai manimai 
प्रतिमाष्टविधा स्मृता प्रतिमा द डेटी द आइडल द मूर्ति ऑफ द लॉर्ड प्रतिमा अष्टविधा स्मृता इट इज कंसिडर्ड एज एट टाइप्स द विग्रह द लॉर्ड हूम वी वर्शिप इधर इन द हाउस और इन द टेम्पल इट इज ऑफ एट टाइप्स देर इज नो नाइन्थ टाइप सो वाट एवर यू आर डूइंग पूजा एट होम आर इन द टेम्पल दे मस्ट कम अंडर एदर वन ऑफ दिस नव फस्ट वन ईज शैली शैली मीन शिला संबंधी शैली स्टोन यू सा द राम विग्रह बालराम नाट बलराम बालराम बालराम राम इन बॉयुड आर् चइलुड वाट इज दट कृष्णशिला कृष्णशिला मीन ब्लैक स्टोन ब्लैक ब्यूटी राम ईज ए ब्लैक ब्यूटी हाउ ब्यूटिफुल राम सो स्मिंग Along with that, they are with artificial intelligence. They are making Lord Rama to smile, to open eyes, look here and there. People are really hmm, become mad after seeing that Lord Rama opening eyes and talking also. <laughs> hmm? Lot of things are going on. Anyhow, they are all only artificial intelligence. A I they say. Hmm? Shaili means Shila Sambandhi Shaili. that uh, murti can be in the made out of a stone like ram temple like balaji temple all agama shastra temples all places the murti will be in black stone only made out of black stone black granite they say but this is from specially they brought from nepal uh, shaili number 2 darumai that idol can be made out of wood also especially you can see in puri jagannath subhadra krishna and balarama their idols are made out of wood hmm? um, daru means wood darumai means made out of wood lauhi third type of idols can be gold loha लोहस्य इयम लोही नर गोल्ड मेटल दे कैन डू सिल्वर आल्सो कम्स अंडर मेटल ओनली सम पीपल कीप सिल्वर आल्सो लेपिया फोर्थ वैरायटी ऑफ विग्रहस आर लेपिया मींस विथ मड विथ मड मींस विनायक चतुर्थी वी डू with mud only we make it uh, that uh, even uh, vijay dashmi time also in kolkata bengal they do with uh, mud only afterwards they put some paints colors and all uh, that is called lepya mud then lekhya fifth variety of idol can be uh, lekhanam ante chitra lekhanam painting Tanjavur paintings you can see all gods are available in Tanjavur paintings. So in many houses we can see Tanjavur paintings, uh, Chitra Lekhan Dwara. You can worship. You can keep that uh, photo in your puja room. You can uh, take that type of idol also. That is also come under Pratima. Legs are there, hands are there, body is there, eyes are there. So ornaments are there. all are uh, there now no, everybody is loves to see rama now <laughs> his ornaments uh, his dress uh, so many are there people are just pouring lot of gold lot of diamonds lot of vastrams what not everything they are giving hmm? rama is the most richest <laughs> person he lived in forest <laughs> without anything but people are making him so rich lekhya then uh, sixth one is uh, um, how many over shaili number 1 darumai number 2 lauhi number 3 lepya number 4 lekhya number 5 sixth one is saikati saikati means made out of sand that is also 
ओके लाइक लॉर्ड रामा डिड शिवलिंग इन रामेश्वरम विथ सैंड ओनली दैट ओशन द बैंक ऑफ द ओशन ही टुक द सैंड एंड मेड शिवलिंग टू दैट ओनली ही वर्शिप रामा वेर कैन ही गो फॉर आइडल देर देर फॉर ही डिड दैट सैकत लिंगम ओके दट सैकत लिंगम Uh, one person want to take bath and he went there and he has got one ragi patra so he want to um, keep it safe what he did he took uh, some sand outside and he kept that ragi uh, patra inside and uh, on the top uh, he made a shivalinga he made a shivalinga and went to take bath and after bath he came and saw there are so many shivalingams hmm? uh, he forgot where i kept my tamram uh, patram see these people all are uh, not thinking what for i have done but uh, everybody thought oh, to take bath everybody has to do saikata lingam that's why everyone started doing saikata lingam therefore he started uh, crying ayyo i have lost my uh, tamra bhajanam that is a shloka is there gatanu gatiko lokaha na lokah paramarthikah setau saikata lingena nashtam me tamra bhajanam in that shloka what he says he is a poet that's why he is telling uh, गतानुगतिको लोक पीपल शीपिश मेन्टालिटी वन पर्सन डज वै दे आर् डूयिंग दे डू नाट नो वन पर्सन डिड देर फॉर ई वॉन्ट टू डू लाइक दैट दे डिड शिवलिंगम्स वन बै वन वन बै वन वन बै वन गतानुगतिको लोक न लोक पारमाथिक दे डू नाट नो वै दे आर् डूयिंग वाट फॉर् दे आर् डूयिंग दे डू नाट नो जस्ट इमिटेशन imitation is the be- biggest weakness in every person like our children imitate you know, sports people the craft with the shirt the dress the action and wearing the spectacles also <laughs> they imitate actors actresses like that imitation uh, everybody want to imitate like that he says na loka paramarthika setau saikata lingena setau means in the rama setu near that saikata lingena i did saikata lingam the sand lingam nashtam me tamra bhajanam i have lost my this copper vessel i do not know where i kept now because everywhere shivalingams are there <laughs> just a joke okay to say that people have got sheepish mentality one person change the god and a new god he comes and uh, this person also will change giving up the from tradition from uh, ancestors they are worshiping the lord they give up from so many generations they are worshiping the kuladaivam they give up and uh, recently who came one year back two years back or 10 years back uh, they worship that god and you see that god is uh, they are thinking he is god and everywhere temples lot of crowd they don't go to the, our uh, ranganatha swami temple or kapaleshwar temple or parthasarathi temple but they go to that mailapur so and so place particularly heavy crowd you can see how you can change your god god also they change what is this na, na lokah paramarthikah so that is so people's sheepish mentality like that here also um, saikata saikati nar made out of sand then uh, seventh type of uh, idol is manomayi that uh, idol which is made in the form of thought in your th- mind in the thought form that also you can worship but it is not easy for all people to worship that mental deity who is in your mind thought form that manomayi idol also one can worship by all this what you come to know the versatile 
nature of worshipping the Lord in different ways. That is why Sanatana Dharma gives a lot of freedom, lot of choice for all people. We accept all people here as long as you should not, you don't, won't destroy others, you don't uh, no, uh, give pain to others, you go on your own way, you worship, it doesn't matter. But don't hurt others in the name of religion. Don't fight each other in the name of uh, the people in uh, Tamil Nadu, you know, all mantra should be in Tamil. Uh, Rama is Aryan God, Uttar Bharat God, so Muruga only is a Dravidian God, like that all these people spreading this type of thoughts in the minds of people, spoiling Hinduism. Hinduism is disturbed by this type of people. Why in Sanskrit every mantra should be in Tamil, in temples, they should not be in uh, Tamim, Sanskrit. All Tirumandiram, Tiruvachikam, Tiruvambhavai, Tiruppavai, all are based on Sanskrit only. They were all Sanskrit scholars because for the sake of Pamarajanas, uneducated people, they are all written in mother tongue, Tamil. It does not mean they do not know Sanskrit. They have whatever said in Vedas in Sanskrit, that only they have written in Tamil here. But the fanaticism, language fanaticism, Muruga, my God is Muruga, that is why they have not given holiday to that day. No? Rama, Pratishta, okay? no holiday. But Muruga, Taipusa, no holiday. Hmm. This type of uh, uh, thinking uh, disturbs the people, the Sanatana Dharma. Lot of things are going on in Tamil Nadu, especially such a great culture, the land of temples. Thank God, because of so many great kings and great uh, um, Bhagavatars, still uh, this culture is alive. Hmm? They are trying to destroy this uh, culture somehow. They want to bring Dravidian culture. Where is Dravidian culture without Bharatiya culture? In Bharatiya culture, only Dravidian culture is there. There is no separate Dravidian culture. Muruga you worship. What about Shiva? Shiva God. Muruga is the son of Shiva. Uh, Muruga is the son of Parvati. Mm, like that. That's why everywhere in Tamil Nadu you can see Vinayaka, Ganesha. Every corner of the street, Vinayaka, Vinayaka, Vinayaka. Okay. Saikati. Mano Mai, Mani Mai also, even in diamonds, Marakata Lingam they say, Marakata Mani, with that also, Pratima Ashtavidha, these are all eight types, there is no ninth type, hmm? Pratima Ashtavidha, eight fold, Smrita, considered as eight fold, Aradhana can be done to the deity which is made out of any one of this eight. What you are doing, you look into eight of this. You may doing some painting, photo you are worshipping, or stone, or metal, whatever may be, panchaloha, like that. Next one. This Murti is now, he is going to talk about um, two types of uh, Murtis are there. Like uh, mobile land, mobile land and the landline. Uh, like landline and mobile line, mobile phone, Bhagavan also, you know Utsav Murti and uh, Garbhagraha, that another Murti. There are two types, that is what he says here. Verse number 13. Chala chale tidvividha pratishtha jiva mandiram Udvasa vahane nastaham sthiraya uddhavarchane sthiraya he uddhava archane for the sake of worship images images which are in the temples generally in the temples vigrahams 
दे आर डिवाइडेड इंटू टू विविधा प्रतिष्ठा दे आर इंस्टॉल्ड इन टू वेज यू सा इन द राम टेम्पल बालराम वन स्थिर मूर्ति हि विल नाट मूव देर इज अनदर उत्सव राम टू टेक ऊर्वलम दट मीन प्रोसेषन ए स्ट्रीट स्ट्रीट दे विल टेक् लाइक दैट इन तईपूसम इन तिवाड़ मरदूर लास्ट वीक वेन ई वेन्ट महालिंग स्वामी द उत्सव मूर्ति ब्रॉट इन द कैप्ट इन द चारियट एंड नेक्स्ट फस्ट विनायक दुर्गा दणेश शिव महालिंग स्वामी एंड पार्वती अंबा then nandikesh so all of them have got chariots puja swami ji uh, made those chariots for that temple because uh, one generation there were no temples there were no chariots such a big temple ancient temple and uh, few generations back uh, there was a uh, no, chariot urvalam procession but in one generation that means uh, 100 of 100 of years or 200 years there was no chariot because of old chariots uh, they got spoiled then no chariots then later swami ji made uh, those chariots uh, of course by people devotees gave lot of donations and uh, they did and to do that um, ch- chariot urvalam uh, procession 30 lakhs they have to spend for one day hmm? so who people deceased people old people who cannot go to the temple they can watch from their house that is why utsava murti is taken outside the streets every street they take that is the achara still it is there chala achala chala means um, non moving putrama or prarth sarathi temple kapaleshwar there it is not movable they are uh, sthiram one another is utsav murti is chalam pratishtha jeeva mandiram here jeeva means bhagavan ishvara mandiram ishvara mandiram why jeeva mandiram in two meanings we can take from advaiti standpoint and uh, uh, ordinary jeeva yati iti jeeva han bhagavan is one who enlivens the jeeva that's why jeeva mandiram our body is also a mandiram why bhagavan alone is uh, lending existence consciousness chidabhasa in this body to function this body therefore i become jeeva how because of chidabhasa given by ishvara therefore this body is called jeeva mandiram jeevaatma in that deho devalaya proktah sajeevah kevala shivahana paramatma only is there inside so from advaita angle also you can see uh, and um, jeevayati iti jeevah jeeva mandiram he enlivens for that there is a pramanam in upanishad also anena jeevena vyakaravani so atmana jeevena vyakaravani in the form of jeevatma i manifest in the body that is the reason we keep your body so clean with mantra japa dhyanam yoga abhyasa and uh, doing alankarana alankarana is not for fashion now cosmetics beauty parlors are all coming for skin care hair nail nail care hair care like that actually our people they decorate the body because it is the bhagavan's vasam vasam means house bhagavan residing in that that is the reason every day we have to give bath every day we have to keep it clean and decorate this body because it is alayam deho devalayam nar inside sa kevala shiva means mangala swarupa bhagavan that is the reason jeeva mandiram bhagavan says here udvasa avahane sam mobile like salagrama is 
uh, you need not do pratishtha there sanagrama means vishnu that's all but in turmeric powder you have to do ganesha avahanam then afterwards after puja over adhasthanam pratishtha payami udvasana sending back but uh, immobile uh, um, achalam um, idols and all you need not do avahanam udvahanam but when you do temporarily there you can do avahana udvasana avahana udvasana means uh, invoking and uh, sending to take rest bhagavan bhagavan that is done for stationary you need not do that stationary suppose some people carry their idols when they are going that puja panchayatana puja the person who does regularly he carries all those uh, panchayatana vigrahas and uh, wherever he is there he keep that panchayatana vigrahas and do puja therefore he has to do avahanam udvasanam there but in garbhagriha you need not do because they are sthiram in salagrama also you need not do avahanam because salagrama means vishnu shivalinga also you need not do shiva avahanam why shivalinga means shiva there is no need of avahanam but in um, that turmeric powder you have to do avahanam that is the idea nastaha udvasa avahane nastaha they are not there for sthirayam which idols are very steady in one place perfectly uh, they need not do that balaram every day they need not do avahanam please come friend uh, they cannot move at all so steady firm that sthirayam he uddava for archane archana purpose they need not do invocation and they need not send that idol back for sthiram okay that is the idea next uh, shloka shloka number 14 asthirayam vikalpasyast sthandile tu avedvayam snapanam tu avilepyayam anyatra parimarjanam now when these uh, idols are eight types uh, what we have to do to which idol you can do abhishekam which idol you should not do abhishekam which idol you can do just uh, cleaning that is given here it is simple you also can know asthirayam vikalpaha syat when the idols are not sthiram not sthiram asthirayam vikalpaha either this way or that way either you can give bath or you need not give bath asthirayam syat sthandile sthandila means raised platform suppose they keep with mud with mud they raise the platform and keep the install the uh, deity you cannot pour lot of water for abhishekam that mud platform will be melted away will go away such places you should not do bhavedvayam sometimes without disturbing the mud you can give bath suppose the mud is going to disturb means you should not give bath at that time how uh, to snaparnam to avilepyayam anyatra in some places you have to do only parimarjanam suppose painting uh, um, frame is there anjaur paints uh, you keep that vigraha that idol the lord in the frame photo you cannot pour milk you cannot pour chandan curds etc abhishekam nan pandrayandi you cannot do you can do only parimarjanam cleaning wiping the photo chitra lekhanam 
or in any uh, painting also that frame you should not uh, do any abhisheka for that um, then uh, snapanam means bath um, your the ritualistic uh, uh, bath is recommended for that lord parimarjani in a mud form of deity you are not supposed to suppose in amarnath uh, you want to do a vishekam for that uh, snow <laughs> lingam uh, snow lingam already snow it is melting away how can you pour water you cannot pour water you cannot do a vishekam from the top water little little water is falling down and it appears like a shivalinga sometimes it appears like shivalinga when i went in the year of 1984 i went to amarnath to see that uh, shivalinga same so 3 4 feet height uh, you can see because water is uh, dip by dip and it's coming down and it appears as shivalinga you cannot give bath there only archana puja even you cannot do parimarjanam also hmm? that full of snow even kedarnath also that stone is swayambhu there is no such uh, particular form is there for that stone they do uh, abhisheka you can do because it is a stone strong place stiram you can do abhisheka these are all said in agama shastra lord krishna is telling i have given all of them according to uh, the deity metal or uh, uh, painting or whatever <coughs> all of them um, upacharas there are 64 upacharas are there chatushashti upachara hmm? eight with eight mantras you can do upachara with 16 mantras you can do upachara with 108 mantras you can do upachara with 1000 mantras you can do upachara hmm? all are upachara only but don't do apachara <laughs> okay whatever you know freedom lot of freedom is there in our hindu dharma sanatana dharma worshiping the lord tremendous freedom people that's why in every temple you can see the bhaktas they are so free to worship the lord you can see the crowd in that ayodhya now we people cannot even imagine to go there such a crowd lakhs and lakhs of people are coming Uh, and shraddhalu with so much of winter climate is also not uh, congenial but they are all happy and lot of food mm, people are sending and a lot of uh, darshanam they are getting you know, so nice to see that uh, whole world is uh, in a new vibration resonance rama bhakti samrajyam ఏ మానవుల కందేనో మనసా అని త్యాగరాజ సాంగ్ ఆల్ కీర్తన సఫర త్యాగరాజ టుడే త్యాగరాజ ఆరాధనోత్సవం యూ మైట్ హ్యావ్ సీన్ దట్ పంచరత్న కృతిస్ ఆన్ ఆల్ కీర్తనాస్ అండ్ రామా ఓన్లీ సో లార్డ్ రామా ఈజ్ ద హీరో ఆఫ్ అవర్ సనాతన ధర్మ అవర్ కల్చర్ ద చిల్డ్రన్ షుడ్ వర్షిప్ గాడ్ ఫ్రమ్ యంగ్ ఏజ్ then that samskara will slowly take them to the highest goal of human being with this uh, i conclude today more in the next class om purnamada purnamidam purnat purnamudachyate purnasya purnamadaya purnameva vasishyate ఓం శాంతి 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 హరి ఓం శ్రీ గురుభ్యో నమ హరి ఓం